this second award is given for leadership. And leadership is nothing more than an opportunity to serve. It is not a trumpet call to self-importance, quite the opposite in fact. It is about humility, sacrifice, hard work, and honor. When the citizens of this organization identified a systemic problem in the jail booking process, it was Officer Mark Spencer who came forward and said, how can I help you fix this problem for the good of us all? And then he stood side by side with us until the job was done. During the most recent budget crisis in Phoenix, when city management was deliberately and callously pitting the citizens against one another and public safety to balance their budget, it was Officer Mark Spencer and the men and women that he leads who refused to abandon the most vulnerable citizens to protect themselves. He united our community, citizens and officers, and led the way in protecting both, no matter the cost for himself. Even in the final hour, when tempted to hand over the interests of the citizens he had given his word to protect, he stood like a wall in front of us and would not stand down. Officer Spencer, today we gratefully honor your devotion and service to our community and give you and your family our deepest thanks. I had to ask Ann to bring a banner, and this is all we get. <laughs> <laughs> you heard from my fear here an uh, important concept, and it's easy to fly by that concept. The concept is teamwork. Um, it wouldn't be here if it weren't for teamwork. Um, you live and die by the. You live and die by the team. We would not be here today. First of all, if it weren't for Phoenix police officers. They pay some heavy bills. They pay some heavy bills, not only in union dues, uh, but with their lives. And uh, uh, like I said, we are here to serve them. It's a great privilege to serve Phoenix police officers. I mean, you've got 24, 2,500 alpha males with guns. And then you've got some alpha, triple alpha females. Uh, and when they trust you to serve and protect them, there's I can't think of much of a higher honor than that. That's an important team. That's the reason why we're here but today. Tell you what, another important team, too, is the plea team. I'm, I'm my buddy Mir Cog in the wheel. I'm part of a team. And my goal is to help them succeed. That's what a leader is. A leader helps others succeed. A leader is committed to the success of others and do what you do best and my role is to help these guys in the plea office here and our reps do what they do best you know what the quickest way not to become the police chief is to become a union rep <laughs> <laughs> and they know that come on and so they're here to serve not that it's wrong to be the police chief <laughs> but they know it up front it's a team effort and, and the third team that you really need to pay attention to is our community uh, and uh, you guys are more than partners Paul you're more than a partner you're a friend I mean, you come to my couch any day and lay on it like you've done in the past <laughs> I know <I'm> <laughs> when I look at Donna and Jerry you know I, I, I always had concerns Mike I don't know if I would share my wife with 2,500 alpha males with guns <laughs> uh, but it hasn't hurt Donna much when Jerry did that and wouldn't be here you know you've heard the song uh, I was country when country wasn't cool well Donna was community activist when community activist wasn't cool and I don't know if we have wonderful partners even outside the community too Sheriff Arpaio thanks for being here you're a friend No, you're over the target when you're taking flack. That's why you're taking flack. Because you're over the target. Now, I have to tell you, I told my dad that Paul was the best looking sheriff in the country, but that doesn't eliminate you being the toughest. <laughs> I, I see our friends with council people here. Sal and Feld, I can't appreciate enough that you're being here. And once again, there's another partnership with the council. It's just so many things. Uh, I tell you, there, there's no room in <coughs> success for arrogance. It just it doesn't work. It just doesn't work, and it, and it ends in failure. 
And I guess uh, there's so many people I could thank, but, but last of all, I, I gotta thank Ann. Um, don't take this the wrong way, Ann. I think we've only known each other for about two or three years, but it seems like 20. <laughs> 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 we say and do things in front of Anne that we would never do in front of our mothers <laughs> or our wives for that matter but uh, you know what if you want to see a true leader you need to look to people like Donna and Anne